I often tell couples um, as well, and even single people, that um, it's almost like love secures your insecurities. So instead of making fun of your partner's insecurities or demeaning their insecurities or um, things like that, you actually secure their insecurities by deeply loving them. Love in and of itself doesn't need redemption. It's we that need redemption. And love is the only thing really that we have that can truly redeem us. And love is the only thing that can truly redeem a dying relationship. Before you look for things in a mate, I think one of the things that singles miss is looking at things in themselves. And really, it's really hard to love somebody. I always, I often say that, you know, um, in order to be in love, love has to be in you. And many people who are singles who are looking for relationships are actually looking to fill a void for something they don't feel about themselves. It's not until you really get really content and in love with who you are, not externally with your hair and your nails and, and all that, and for guys, your shoes, your job, your money and all that, but internally, when you start to love um, yourself as a person, um, I think is when you prepare yourself to be in love with someone else. So it first has to happen in you. And if it doesn't happen in you, then uh, you'll find yourself in a lot of very heartbreaking situations where people break your heart as well as you break in other people's heart. In the moment, relationship, biggest relationship challenge you have. Go ahead, I wanna fix it in two minutes. I'm gonna fix your, I'm gonna show you that one of the reasons people struggle in relationships so much is not because they don't have the right relationship answers. One of, the, one of the reasons people struggle the most is because they don't ask the right relationship questions. So I want you to give me your biggest relationship issue right now. I'm gonna ask you the right questions in about 120 seconds, and I am going to help you to discover an answer for your situation. Yes. I, I think you're very, I think you're very guarded, right? In, in, your, in your relationship, you're very guarded. You have a reason for being guarded, right? Mm -hmm. For whatever your reasons are, you're very guarded. It's really hard to get to know you um, at a deeper level because number one, you are so careful about the way you let people into your life. And you've got your reasons for doing that. Mm -hmm. And that hinders you from real connection. So you have expectations, like you want things to happen, mm -hmm. but you're so guarded in the way you, in your presentation that um, you make people nervous.